Hello everybody, this is Ryan. This is another episode of Minecraft. Sorry I've been busy for a little while, lots of work to do. But, now we're back. Back to the game. And I haven't been on this world since my last recording, so, um... My apologies, I haven't done any work at all. <laughs> been a lot of uh, school going on, school just started up. And, um, lots of work at my job. Lots of work to do. But hopefully we'll be able to get back into the uh, Minecraft spirit again. Um, I can't promise that it will be a long episode today. But hopefully it will be somewhat decent. Alright, let's see here. Yeah, see, like I said, haven't done any work. Of course, I did chop down all of those trees when uh, the recording had mistakenly stopped last time. I have gotten a new keyboard since. It's a uh, Razor Anasi, and it works very well. And uh, yeah, it complements my mouse. I'm able to change the color of it to the LEDs red, which is very nice, I do say so. So, you know, let's just harvest all this wheat and breed our cow pit. I, stu I did upload a, another video about a game called Don't Starve, and uh, I hope everybody enjoyed that. There was quite a few views on it, which I was a bit surprised at, because I had recorded that very early in the morning. It was probably around, uh, let's see, maybe like 2 o'clock, maybe, maybe 3 but it, w it was really early, but I, I just didn't want to go to sleep yet. I, I wanted something to do, so I played some Don't Starve. <laughs> and um, I did get a message that did say they enjoyed it. So maybe I'll do some more of that. I mean, I don't know too much about the game. So I guess it would be a bit interesting to see how far along I would get, considering the last time I only did survive eight days, and then um, these big dogs came after me and killed me. Which which sucks, but, you know, what are you gonna do? I haven't looked up anything about the game on any wikis or anything, so, like I said, I'm, I was just playing it blindly. I only know as much as I'm, like, building and getting and stuff like that. Yeah, cows. Let's just walk around here real quick. Oh, there was some stuff down here. Yeah, I've been trying to, uh, along with the sugar cane, I've been trying to uh, collect a lot of that for uh, bookcases. Huh, that's strange. Oh well. Guess one of them suffocated in a wall or something. Oh. Man, I think the render's down quite low. Ten chunks. Let's put it up to twelve. See how that looks from here. Seems to run smoothly still. Which is good. It's always good. Hmm. Alright. Yeah, what I would like to get done today is, um... I'd like to maybe open up this staircase a bit. And, um... That might be all we were able to get done today, just considering uh, timing issues. Hmm. Yeah, I wanna, I wanna open all of that up. Let's see here. No. I was playing some Mind Z yesterday. I was at my girlfriend's house and we were playing that for a while which it it's always fun playing that although just like uh, typical IRL things they they steal the food from you and they take all your good stuff I guess you know who I'm referring to but I um, I ended up dying and I spawned over in the uh, swampy area and I murdered the one who had killed us earlier because I guess he had died and he was in the same town and he was complaining to his friend about not having a sword so I went up there and killed him 
and then I ran off. And I guess I reached the side edge of the uh, swamp world because it said you've reached the end of the world. Won't let me go any further. So instead, I just started traveling east, was it? Yeah, I started traveling east. And I ended up coming across the forest there where there was a river. And half of the river was ice and the other half was water. And I was already starving as was, and I was surviving off the of zombie flesh. It's a huge surprise to me that I didn't um, die of the sickness. Getting down with the sickness. Alright, but yeah, I, it was surprising to me. And I just kept walking and walking, and I thought I was going south. I, I didn't press F3. And I ended up looking across the water when I reached a gap. And it was just there was a huge volcano <laughs> well maybe not volcano but it was just like a big stone mountain with lava everywhere and I was just like holy crap I just made it to the north and and that's that's what happened I was in full leather armor with a almost done wooden sword and here I am just sitting up there and I didn't think I was going to survive. I was I was so freaked out. I was like, oh my god, oh my god. I just I made it all the way up here without encountering anybody. What should I do now? And um, I looked at the map, and I, I obviously pressed F3 at this point because it mattered. And I looked at the map, and I was close to uh, this castle, and it said there was food there. So I was just like, oh man, oh man, i got to get up there because I was down to like three haunches. And I, I was freaking out, and I... I finally got up to the castle and I was on like I was still on two because of uh, luckily there was like half slabs and stuff to get me up there but I was down to no hunger left waiting there for a chest uh, with food in it to spawn and I was I was I was just so frustrated because I had made it up this far and I had all this good gear now from the castle and I was just gonna die and you know, nobody wants to die like that. I mean, it's it's no fun. So, a tip went by. That's usually when the chests respawn. And so here I am, racing to this chest as my health is dwindling down. I got down to like three hearts. I had to drink the only health potion that I had. I broke the chest. Two apples in a bowl came flying out of it. I made mushroom stew as fast as I could. Ate the mushroom stew. Ate the two apples. And I was at full health again. And I was just like, holy crap. Did I just do that? You know, I wish I I wish I could have been recording, but I mean I I wasn't in the uh, right place to be doing so. I wasn't at home, like I said, no internet right now. And it unfortunately, as it might be, I it might have to be delayed even longer, which is it's upsetting to me, but at the same time, it's like, I mean, what are you going to do? Just because, you know, I mean, it's tough to come by money these days. Especially for things like that. Yeah, sorry about that, uh, jets. They're just, uh, still flying by. Managing to ruin every recording I make. What are you talking about, Ryan? They're ruined everywhere, they suck. All right, let's see how that looks right now. See, I like the big opening like that, but I want it to be taller. So, I'll tell you what. There's going to be a big transition here, and I'm just going to... How should I say it? Yeah, I have to get ready for work now. Sorry. It may have only been a few minutes here. I'm not. I'm not sure. I haven't been keeping track, but... I have to get ready for work. When I get back, I'll dig all that out, and um, we'll see where we go from there. We'll see what the design might be. Until then. Hello, everybody. It's Ryan. My apologies. I had started a video. I had some very nice footage going on. I fell into a little thing over there, almost died, and I pressed the wrong recording button. And... So there's that. Kind of upsetting, but, you know, what are you going to do? <sighs> Big sigh.
You know, I, I that's probably twice I've done this now, and I just got the new keyboard, so, uh, damn it. Very upsetting. I also moved the microphone, made it in a bit more, uh, less close place. Hopefully you can't hear me, uh, smacking my lips and all that jazz anymore. Hopefully. But, uh, I didn't do much. I just had uh, showed you the grand staircase that I have been working on a bit. Haven't really been working on it that much. Have a lot of have a lot of work this week, unfortunately. But uh, it should be done at any rate uh, within the next episode. Uh, you'll see it on the way back if I haven't already shown it to you in the past episode from what my uh, work was before. But other than that, not much going on. Yeah, I fell into a cave over there. A uh, damn skeleton got nabbed me into it. Darn. Obsidian. Yeah, we're just gathering 18 pieces of obsidian here for uh, our nether portal. And uh, for enchantments. Which, uh, we don't have the other diamond for enchanting yet. But, hey, let's grab this now. Oof. And hopefully, hopefully it'll, uh, we'll find it soon. First thing I'd like to get is some fortune and those feather falling boots. Man, such a nice pair of boots. I, uh, I don't know if any of anybody who watches me is a YouTuber, but that feeling that you get when you when you make some really nice content I just did that, didn't I? Man. Oh shit shit <laughs> As I was saying that feeling you get when you make some really nice content and then nobody gets to appreciate it it's uh... it's not a nice feeling at all so it was actually kind of upsetting. I mean, I that was probably about 10 minutes there, which uh, isn't so bad. But at the same time, it was uh, that was some valuable time at the moment. So I'm not not too happy. But you know, did, really? Come on. You got and he has an enchanted bow. And where'd you go? Oh, he's in there. Hey, guy. No, you're not gonna... No. You're not... Stepping in this bear turf today. Yeah, so... This week, uh, lots of work to do. Lots of work, indeed. I'm talking, of course, about... IRL. Work. Job stuffs. All that good peanut butter and jelly. So... The video uh, uploading might be a tad slow. I do apologize for that in advance. And, um, you know, hopefully in the next episode we can explore the nether a bit. Maybe, possibly, I'm not sure yet. I think that would be kind of fun. But, uh, I guess we'll cross that bridge when we come to it. I do get a bit of jumpiness whenever I enter the nether on this computer. Uh, which I've learned that might just be an internet connection thing when I was over a uh, friend's house there but if not Then we shall explore the crap out of that place <laughs> Which I which I do I do enjoy looking around in the nether. It's a uh, It's good for adventuring as many of you know <clears throat> All right and, uh, like I said, I was playing some Mine Z over at Miss Gurley's house there. And, uh, I'd like to record some of that when possible. I <clears throat> Excuse me. I'm sure when I do, it'll be a bit random. Like, I'll, uh, one minute I will be just spawning, and then the next I'll be somewhere else because I get extremely sucked into that game. 
and it takes up a lot of time and I just do not have the hard drive space to keep all that footage. As it is, I'm running on a uh, 300 gigabyte hard drive and it's hard to keep all of my videos in one place so I have to move them on a flash drive, upload them on my laptop, and uh, just go from there. But look at all these reeds growing, it's crazy. But uh, hopefully I will be buying some maybe external internal hard drives, I'm not sure which is better for this kind of thing. I'm thinking external so I can just get a thousand terabyte or <laughs> a thousand one terabyte and take it with me where I go and I'll just have it plugged into the uh, computer whenever I'm recording so that's where the uh, videos will go and that'll probably make it a lot easier for me so I can record longer more HD more fun okay so we got our obsidian there oh that <coughs> <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm terribly sorry about that. I think I'm coming down with something. But, um, yeah, that was the grand staircase over there. It's not completely done yet, obviously. I'm going to add some birch wood to the sides, the acacia, just because I wanted to match up with the uh, staircase or the floors. Oh, that's that's good. I haven't, I haven't really looked in here. Sweet, we got some potatoes growing, which I have no room for. Let me just throw those in there. I should probably get some inventory management classes. I think a poisonous one was in that group there. I couldn't tell. Ah, no, I don't I don't want to eat them. Stop trying to get me to eat them. There we go. Now let's get some melons. Okay, so those are melon plants also, but they're just not growing yet. We don't need that many melon pants. Yeah, melon pants. Melon pants! We don't need that many melon pants. I, yeah. Doop, doop, doop. We don't need that many growing right now. But, it's good that we have some, because we'll be able to make some glistering melons. And that is awesome always a nice thing to have. I think the last thing we're gonna do today is portal placement. And if any of others, any of you think with portals as I do, we shall place it right here. I hope there's something, no of course not. Why would there be something under there? I changed back to the shift key because it's in a different place now. So. I'm, but now I'm used to pressing the uh, macros. I think that's what it said they were called. Smarty me. I think that's a good place for that. I might fill that in above there, make it look a bit prettier. But uh, I mean, other than that, I think that's uh, I think that's about it for the day. You know, it's starting to sun's going down. Take one last look at the grand staircase here. Like I said, I want to put some glass right there, have a nice veil going over it. I like the way that's looking. You know, it's a This is like a, this is the largest house I've ever built in Minecraft, a very big project and I'm glad that I'm getting so many views, but at the same time, it's not as much about the views for me as it is What's the word? staying dedicated to a world. I always end up just getting a bunch of diamond and I n never go off and fight the ender dragon or the wither as said in at some point or another. And you know, this uh, this YouTube thing has really kept me dedicated to it. Even though it's only been a few episodes, look how far we've gotten. I mean, diamond already. Got a very nice house going. Better than any house I've ever built before. And you know, it's just, uh, I wanted to give a big thank you to you all for enjoying these, and, uh, thank you to, uh, two of my friends who, uh, go out of their way to share my videos on their tumblers, and 
it's it's greatly appreciated. I wanted to thank both of you. Uh, I didn't know if you wanted your names declared out there on the internet, so sorry. But um, yeah. So that's it for today. See you next time.